So, what's up, guys? Bahama here. <sighs> Finally got a somewhat decent place to clear my mind. And I got some bots walking in and out, walking around me, but it's all right. We chilling. Um, yeah, man, it's just crazy, man. When you try to ask questions, you know, you really try to connect with God and you try to search for answers and wonder why certain things is happening to you. It's like things will just come to you. I don't know how to explain it, man, but it's like I've been trying to explain this situation with this, you know, this targeting and how bad it is with me in uh, Pittsburgh, you know, known throughout. Um, never experienced anything like this before. No, I'm not tripping. Um, this didn't start to me until about uh, three years ago. And it's just crazy, man. I'm just walking through downtown, just observing everyone, just seeing how it is. Just a minute before I even came down here, look, they always got to make sure they, they, he just pulled up. They always got to make sure, man. 24 7 surveillance, man. No escape. Notice how he get notice how he gets out the red car and he's staring directly at me. And you know I keep telling y'all I'd be construction workers that be on my dick. Why he got one of those construction work highlighter things? Everywhere I go, these construction workers are following me. No escape. Literally pulls up, gets out the car, glances at me. I guess he's gonna get out. He's probably gonna walk this way. Is this natural behavior? Is this normal behavior? Nah, man, it's all in your head. These are demons in your head, man. You're tripping. Oh, it gets back in the red car, pulls off. Yep. No, it's all in your head, Laurel. Here's some fucking psycho crazy motherfucker. literally gets out glances at me like come on bro no these are paid actors man you got these are your friends or something dude <laughs> it's just so funny how i'm like literally trying to expose the truth and then when i be trying to explain something get down on my downloads from guys then they just appear and it's like i don't know how much more proof you guys need But like I was saying, man, I was walking through downtown. There's some little event. If you're in Pittsburgh, you know what it is. Tell me why I'm going through the event. Y'all already know, you know, my gang stalkers know. These trolls know. You know, I'm trying to walk through my own business. You know, I got everyone glancing and shit. People doing the little weird eyes and the smirks and the giggling and the shit talking and, you know, you know, directed conversations instead of being a fucking man or a woman and approaching me and expressing your fucking attitude, you know, in my presence. But, you know, they prove to you time and time again who are the real fucking cowards. But um, I'm looking at people and I'm noticing like groups of people with this, this like baseball style looking shirt and it's striped and it has 666 on the back of it and it has violence. Like, on top of the 666. Like, bro, it's like, just a couple of days ago, I made a video talking about, hey, this is fucking satanic-ass fucking city. And, of course, you know, I'm not recording, you know, because majority of the attacks, they don't, they don't really want to get on tape. They just want to get y'all, you know, they want to send stuff like that, little small stuff, you know. They get y'all, ooh, ooh, wow. They don't want to fucking show y'all the full programming. They don't want to show y'all the full, the full skits. You know, how everybody around you be fucking playing this fucking theatrical fucking play. 
it's almost it's so it's so bad to the point where you where you feel like you know motherfuckers be fucking shut down you know out of energy or some shit and then when you come around they boot up and it really do be like that motherfuckers don't even be at at job sites but when you come into the presence, you you happen to come into this area, then oh, they just appear out of nowhere. Like they show y'all shit. They show it. They put the truth in the movies. You remember the Truman Show? Fuck, I don't know how many times I gotta reference that shit, but that's exactly the shit what I've been going through, like and experiencing. Like the lady, fucking, he comes in to try to get a boat. You know, just he does come. He does like a complete one eighty that they weren't expecting. And then she came in with the bib and her shirt, like rushing in. She was on like lunch. She wasn't even like working. These are just they just put people at stations just to fuck with you or to catch you and make sure they're tracking your every move. Like and then that's how I be a lot of that times too. When I be disappearing, it would be cool for a little bit. I don't be seeing nothing, but then the first thing I see be like a dude walk around a corner with a red shirt on or a fucking a red truck or something pulls up like that's the first vehicle i see like what what's that i ain't seen no other cars pull right here what's the first car i fucking see as soon as i start up the video what's the first thing i fucking see like bro like nah you just nah you're just tripping man this dude's a fucking loony bin yeah you know i wish i wish i can just you know live a normal life without having people watch me 24 fucking seven, you know, people fucking on my head case every fucking day talking shit 24 fucking seven fucking using direct. And it's not even just people's probably looking at, Oh, you can't ignore people talking shit. Man, you don't even know the half of it. You don't even know the half of what these fucking demons and these narcs do, bro. You don't know the projection. You don't know the fucking, the gas lighting, like, you don't know the belittlement, like, you don't know how these niggas be trying to treat you like a child and sending people to test you, fucking to try to get a reaction, try to drain your energy, how to, how to get your mood all swinging up and down, left and right, especially if you're the type of person, like, you just, you just hardwire, you know, a lot of these soulless demons, when they look at strong, you know, warriors from God, you know, it's always the same thing. Oh, he he seems like he's high and mighty. Fucking, oh, he thinks he's better than everybody. Oh, it's, oh, he's strong in this, big that, like. And you could have nothing. You can have nothing at all. But yet, and you know, and it's, it's, it's nothing in this world. And that's, that's what they lack. That's what they fail to realize. Their minds, their souls, their whole concept of reality is tied to this world. They don't know what it's like. Huh, this shit is monetary, but what's what's on the other side? Why don't why don't I ever think about things other than what this world tell me to think about? Like I base my I base my whole life. I base my whole fucking life on the spiritual side of things. Cause I see, I see already, bro. Like I've always had that thing in me where I've just seen through the bullshit. Don't so notice how they got to send everybody, man. I'm telling you, you be in the most random places, dude. It don't matter. Like, and it's like that Jesus Bible is is literally. Oh, look, what looks? Look who pulls up first. The red, and then, oh, what do you know? We have the beast. We have the beast. Nah, man, you're tripping. It's all in your head, man. It's all in your head, bro. There's nowhere you can go where these people can't find you. Second car, you telling me I couldn't see a gray sedan pull up, family hop out, you know? Couldn't see a black car, you know. I couldn't see a dude just walking with a shirt off. I couldn't see like a couple walking down, making out or something. Nope. I had to see red, then the beast, and then now this guy. Literally, probably just gonna come and sit right there in an angle to where he can see me and not move for an extremely long time. While I continue making this video, because it's all tactics, it's all games. And if, since this is the third vehicle that it's appeared right here, oh, and what is this? Oh, oh no, you know it's all in your head, Laurel. 
It's all in your head. You're tripping, man. This isn't happening to you. Who do you think you are? <laughs> Who do you think you are? You're you're fucking nobody. Why why would something like this be happening to you? That's like that's this this new age shit. Everyone's fucking spiritual and everyone's a fucking narcissist. And everyone's fucking, oh, your zodiac sign, like fucking surrounded by a bunch of AI fucking people, bro. It's, it's, it's fucking annoying, bro. It's really annoying. My bad. F- fucking up on the camera. Literally hops out, does nothing. Oh, air. Oh, air mark. <laughs> Is that array mark? I can't. I can't really see. I'm sorry. With the five point star, third vehicle that came. What? 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 What have I been explaining to you guys? The subliminal messaging, the numerology, how they always position the ways where you can see them. You can see the games. Perfect angles, twenty four seven. It's oh, it's supposed to be like a dude or whatever, but it, it looks like a five point star, dude. And what's the color of it? Oh, no. No, you're just tripping, Laurel. You're just tripping, man. What have I been talking about? Numerology. Colorometry. Look these things up, man. There's a reason why somebody like me, my account is shadow banned, why I don't be having all these fucking subscribers. When it comes to this technology and worldly things, they only want people to blow up that they want y'all to follow and to, to copy and mimic y'all life after. Man. And it, it took me it took me a long time to realize that, you know, y'all these spiritual people coming out and shit and they thousands of subscribers, millions, no one, you know, just up there, no cancellation, no nothing, but somebody like me who's talking about something like this, shadow ban. You know, trolls all on my page. Like, <laughs> oh man, dude. The truth always sounds fucking more outlandish than the fucking lie. That's crazy. Small percent of us just trying to expose this shit. I don't know, man, but I got this feeling in me, man, that we don't got much time. Like, it's pretty much over. You know, it don't matter what you think about me. You know, whether you think this is, you know, I'm sane, I'm crazy. You know, the fact, the simple fact that people are even sitting here watching instead of actually lending out any type of supportive hand. That's what this test is. That's what life is about. You guys, every every day you wake up, you're 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 taking a test and you don't even know it. What are you gonna do? You when you wake up in the, every morning, what's on your mind? Oh, I'm gonna go help. I'm gonna go help this individual. I'm gonna make this guy feel good. You know, I'm gonna fucking try to change this person's life. You know, I'm going to try to do something different or when you waking up or is it, oh man, fuck this guy. Like, oh, oh, there's this dude again. Oh, don't stay away from him. <laughs> Motherfuckers talk about they're so godly and <laughs> forget God's number one fucking thing. Forgiveness, acceptance. But you guys are such godly people. And God gave me a premonition for how cities are laid out since I've been making videos covering topics about these things and trying to find answers, bro. You've been coming to me in my dreams and shit, whether people think dreams are real or not. But, you know, I've been having downloads and spiritual visions, whatever you want to call them. I don't like speaking about this stuff because I know how majority of these people stuck in society, bro. They don't think with a spiritual mind, bro. So anything that comes, that's, you know, any words or stories about things, you know, spiritual side of life, you know, automatically, you know, 95% of the population is going to fucking assume I'm just fucking completely bonkers, but it's like, time's up, man, 
you know, if you're one of the ones, and I, I know there's ones who are truly studying me, truly know my ins and out, you know, know everything about me, fucking ultra agent, fucking stalking type of agent. But I have a message for you guys too. It doesn't matter what any individual ever did in this world. Understand that you guys are all equal. We are all equal. But understand, someone put us here first. So we don't have the right to govern other fucking human beings. All we have is each other. When you decide you want to become God, that's when you doom your family, your families for generations to come. Enjoy in the moment. Enjoy your blissful life. But you're also going to reap with your soul. So, I don't know where that came from, but This is just a test, man. Don't matter what anyone do. As soon as you decide to fucking take a life and become something more than what you already are, just be ready to deal with the consequences that come after, even if you think you've got, gotten off the hook, and even if you think your actions are justified. No one decides who gets to choose or live but life itself. But, um, yeah, man. This is what I live for right here. Peace, quiet, tranquility. It will be better if motherfuckers wasn't stuck in society and caring about how you look and dress and, you know, caring about these worldly things. I don't know, man. And I'm pretty sure if there's actually individuals who's actually sitting down and actually listen to my videos, whether you like to hear my hear me talk, you know, whether I sound crazy or sometimes sound intelligent. But you can even tell in like how I communicate in my videos and express myself in my videos, like pretty much how these attacks been affecting me. And now it's and now it's like I've been facing them a lot more, but I'm telling y'all, there's something up with this sun. This sun has been feeling so good. Yesterday, I sat out there for so long. I got videos, but I don't even know if I'm going to upload them. But it's just the same bullshit. I pulled up, you know, all the red shit, you know, subliminal messaging, you know, BS. But, um, yeah, I don't want this video to be too long, man. I just wanted to show, talk to y'all a little bit, get some stuff off my chest, express myself, you know give these downloads away don't care